Maryland Black Bear Nation, voice of the Black Bears here, Alex Utano here, assistant coach Brandon Gotkin. Now, Brandon, after the first series against Johnstown, nine goals against in two games, this time only four in two games. What defensive changes did you see between that first and second series against Johnstown? Yeah, our guys did a, a really good job um, just being committed in our own end and, and making smart plays. Um, so credit to them. And uh, as the season progresses, we've started to see a lot more solidification in the lines, pairings between players defensively and offensively. Now, when you're a, take us through the process of evaluating chemistry between two players. What do you really look for? Yeah, uh, it starts in practice, obviously. So at the start of the year, Clint and I kind of sit down and just discuss, you know, uh, what might work and what you know types of looks we're looking for a particular line, and then. Um, on ice during practice, kind of see how they, they work together, and um, over time they start gelling. So it's kind of a, a natural um, progress. So uh, just a little bit of time usually it takes. Now you guys are going to embark on a road trip for three weeks starting this weekend against the Northeast Generals. You can catch those games on Hockey TV. Uh, talk to us. How does all this travel take a toll on the team? What do you guys like to do on the road? Uh, what's a long road trip like for the Black Bears? Yeah, so it's good. Um, you know, it's a good opportunity for our guys to, to, to be together and, and bond, um, being obviously the same hotel room and on the bus for a couple hours. So um, guys do a lot of stuff. I know I, I walk back there playing games and watching movies and chit-chatting and all that good stuff. So um, I like to keep it pretty simple. Usually we'll just do video uh, each day, a review or a preview of a game. Um, and then just have a meal, and then they kind of just are, are getting ready for the game at, on hand. So nothing too crazy, but um, it's definitely a, a good time for everybody together and kind of gel. Well, Brandon, thank you very much for taking the time to talk to us. Now, I noticed that you have something from Frisco's Tap House. That is because on November 13th from 4 to 8 p.m. at the Frisco at Walk Chapel, there will be an event benefiting seats for soldiers that will go towards uh, benefiting soldiers for the December 7th uh, Military Appreciation Night here at Piney Orchard Ice Arena. Now, for fans going to this event, they might not have been to Frisco's before. What would you recommend? What is your favorite thing from their menu? Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff, but uh, I definitely like the uh, fried devil eggs and the uh, fried green tomato sliders are, are also another favorite of mine. So you can't go wrong with too many things there, so definitely those are my two go-tos. Such as the Black Bear Burger, which is also served there. Macaroni cheese bacon on a burger. Sounds delicious. And if you're wondering about the sweatshirt I'm wearing, details will be to come on the website. However, one of these will be raffled off November 13th at Frisco. It's a great sweatshirt, very comfy, customized with name and number. If you want a chance to win this at the raffle November 13th at Frisco, we hope to see you there. Let's go Black Bears.